A freshman state senator is making a move to win re-election in a new district. Redistricting pitted Sarah Trone Garriott against a fellow Democrat in a primary next year. Instead, she decided to move west to a new district, which Trone Garriott says makes up about 80% of her old district. I just feel a really strong connection to all the people in my district, but was really moved to serve that Western side to make sure that they had a state senator who was going to show up for them, listen to them, and bring people together for the common good. John Garriott will face off against Republican Jake Chapman next November. Chapman currently serves in the old District 10. We have reached out to Chapman for comment, but we have not yet heard back. Meanwhile, Senate Majority Leader Jack Whitver is also moving districts. He announced this week he's seeking re-election. Whitver currently serves Senate District 19, which encompasses Ankeny, Sailorville, and Alleman. Whitver says he'll now run in District 23, which is vastly more rural. The new district still includes Alleman, but runs along the easternmost part of Polk County up to the Story border and west into Dallas County. Should he win, he'd no longer serve Ankeny, but would pick up uh, Grimes, Granger, and a portion of Urbandale. An Iowa doctor and infectious disease specialist at Broadlawns is running for the Iowa State House. Dr. Megan Srinivas announced her candidacy and kicked off her campaign just a half hour ago at Confluence Brewing in Des Moines. She's a Democrat running for House District 30, the southwestern uh, most portion of Des Moines. Srinivas also ran in 2018 for the House District representing Fort Dodge, but lost to the Republican candidate.